Hi everyone, today we're going to take a look at the song House of Cards by Radiohead. We are in drop D tuning and we have a capo on the third fret. Lowest string, tune down to D. So, let's start. So that is the intro and basically most of the song. Um, we have um, the 12th fret. I'm gonna give you the exact numbers. 12th fret, A. So I would put the ring finger, the A string, and our pinky on the G string. D string is muted, E string is open. Like this. Then we have 12, 10, and then 0. And then 10, 0. Like this. Um, we switch the chord to this one, also very nice. You can always kind of fool around between these two chords. It's always going to sound correct. And here we do the same thing, like we have uh, 12 on the A string, and then we have 10 on the G string. And we do the same bass line. Here we have 2 and 2, now it's relative to the capo, so 2 and 2 on the low E string and the D string, so. So we take this shape to 12 and 15. So cool. Yeah, you can also you can really use the open the open tuning to a hammer on. Yeah, sometimes you let it ring, sometimes you don't. Such a cool song. So um, for the verse we have I don't want to be a friend. So we have this shape. But anyways, you can always just play around with those two. I don't want to be a friend. I just want to be a lover. So if this this chord, like here, we have the um, the eighth fret, on the low E string, and eighth fret on the G string. We 
change between 8 and 7 here. So that's really cool. I just wanna be a friend. I just wanna be a lover. Okay, mm. then at some point um, we play this one longer. Fall off the table, don't so um, I've seen during the um, the live version from the basement, um, Tom York sometimes does, and and some some variations. So he. At one point he does like an like an F chord without the bass note. But you don't have to do this, it's just you it's enough to do. That's the chorus. So and and yeah, this this part from the intro is like the chorus. This tonight, 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 tonight. And um, there's this little guitar melody going. So it's open, open A, hammer on the second fret, then the open D, back to A. You can also do it like, like with a slide. But yeah, that's up to you. Um, yeah. Then, um, I mean, for example, during the intro, Ed O'Brien does this thing where he just does these percussive sounds uh, with some effects. It's funny how often they just make noises. Um, one cool thing that happens during the song is um, Johnny Greenwood, uh, he plays... Whoop, lost my plectrum, lost my pick. Um, he uses a coin like this, and he does some kind of like a bottleneck technique. First, I'm going to show you the, the notes, if you want to play it without. So we have the open G string, then three, five, and ten, and then we switch to ten on the B string. Sometimes I'm giving you the names according to the capo, sometimes don't. I don't, sorry. <laughs> and then you can make a little bending. Um, I'm going to switch the sound um, to show you what uh, Johnny Greenwood does. Uh, I'm going to put on a little reverb and stuff. Uh, he takes a coin... Uh, for me, that's 50 cent. I don't have a pound or something. Maybe you're in England. Uh, I guess it just works properly with a pound. Um, and he does this very cool thing. I hope you can hear this properly. So you, he doesn't change the sound with something he does up here, but he does it like as if you were playing with a, with a bottleneck. So he's he's holding it like this, and then a little bit like a like a tremolo, but you're not 
you don't have to go super fast or super heavy, just very softly. That's a very cool trick. Yeah, I guess um, you're gonna have fun with that one. Um, he doesn't play with a with a capo, I think, so he has the the uh, completely open strings. Yeah, you're gonna gonna find that. Out. There are also some some covers on YouTube for that part. I just think it's very cool how much you can do just with a coin. Um, so yeah, that is uh, that is lots of is lots of fun. I think I've seen Adrian Ballou do the same at some point, maybe with Talking Heads. I'm not 100% sure, but yeah, but yeah. Wow. So cool. <laughs> so yeah, um, and that is, and that is, <laughs> that is House of Cards with lots of, lots of reverb. Uh, that is House of Cards by Radiohead. <laughs> Yeah, it's it's so cool. Uh, and I would make the case that um, In Rainbows is in fact their best album. Crucify me, but I think that's a legitimate thing to say. Okay, uh, thanks for watching and see you next time.